guys, we're at Wickham Air. We're at Wickham uh, Air Park today, and Peter and I, gonna, like I said the other day, we're gonna go for a little spin. So, just walking over to Peter's aircraft now, which you can see in front of us. So, today, we're gonna go for a little blast over London. You remember, guys, I said the other day that we're gonna do that. Well, here we are today. Lots of people. We're gonna take the cameras, we're gonna have some fun. Let's do this. So Peter, when we do the checks, what is it that you're checking? Just run us through, just very basic. I've switched on the battery. Yep. To check I've got battery. Yep. 25.1, so enough to start her. Um, it's a turbine, so you have to be able to turn yep. the turbine with the battery before she fires. Checking my strobe light works, and I'm also checking that my enunciator panel works, and the yep. little computer, the EMU works. So that's all good. I can switch all that off, and I had the fuel, and I took the rotor brake off while I was at it, so she's in a flying position. Excellent. Um, and then I'm going to walk around. Okay, so we'll just do a quick walk around. So if there's no oil leaks, things that are fixed should stay fixed. That's all I'm looking for. This is how I left her the last time I, yep. I was able to fly her. And, but you never know, someone else might have flown her in between. Yeah, absolutely. Um, and I'm just looking inside the rotating parts. There's no debris or anything in there. I check the things that Where's your pito airspeed indicator? On, obviously on the front, I'm guessing. Yeah, pito is here. Ah, uh, okay, yeah. yeah. And that's a heated pito. Ah, uh, okay, yeah. It should be fixed, they don't want them to fall off. Okay, I check. Coming around, looking at I've got my oils. Yeah. Oil in there. Teletemp is, is fine. That would tell me what the bearing's heating up. I just check I've got movement in my foot pedals. Nice, nice and smooth. Yeah. Means all this is clean. This is the oil cooler. Yeah. I've got oil, but I just check the levels. You know, it's always you need the fluids to fly and to rotate. And then I've got my cooler for the engine. That's a little device at the end. And then there's another. And you won't be able to see that. There's my gearbox and my hydraulics. So there's gearbox level and there's a hydraulics level. So just checking fluids. Yep. Again, anything that should be fixed is fixed. Anything that should move, should move. There's pressures come up. We won't see the oil temperature coming up yet. The gas compressor is now spinning up to 14%. The temperature is now stabilizing about 500. Smell that jet fuel. Yeah, depends which way the wind is blowing.
There we go guys, Peter and I have just had awesome fun cruising around London. I said we we're gonna do it, and Peter's an awesome instructor. <laughs> Flying, relatively simple. Hovering, wow. <laughs> I have so much more respect for helicopter pilots. Wow, it's not easy. However, starting to get it after a while. Yeah. But uh, that was an awesome day, guys. And I think we're going tomorrow as well. So, uh, we're gonna go and grab something to eat now, but that was just an awesome day. I, I really enjoyed that. The last time I was in a helicopter, was when I was rescued out in the Atlantic. So this was different, this was very different and a bit more enjoyable. A bit more in control. All right, let's go get something to eat. I know if you notice, trying to calm this ocean without your love.